my channel. It's time for another Dollar Tree haul. Uh, as of late, my Dollar Tree has been having a bit of a dry spell, so I kind of got lucky with a lot of the items I'm going to show you today. Got a new little uh, display thing for you so it can make the products stand out better. And I have a little bit of a question for you before I start. Uh, I want to know if you prefer this format where you see the products up close in just my hands, or if you prefer the format where you see me and a little bit less close up of the products. Um, let me know in the description box below, description box really, sorry, uh, down in the comment section below of how you would prefer to see the hauls. But let's not waste any time, let's get right into it. First thing I got is something I get all the time, I can't rave about it enough, and that is of course LA's Totally Awesome Oxygen oxygen based cleaner. It is better in my opinion than um, OxyClean. Uh, you get 16 ounces. I wish that these tubs were as big as the orange based cleaners that you get but you can't have everything and it's only a dollar. Next thing, another boring item but uh, I really suggest these after having gotten these a few times. Uh, and that is the uh, paper towels by the home store. You get a hundred uh, sheets and they are very absorbent. This is going to be a little bit of a TMI, but I'm going to be honest with you. They're good enough that you can clean up pet messes. Let's just put it that way. Um, I buy these every time that I go as kind of a staple. So don't hesitate to buy these and they are really worth it. As the point where my husband even likes to buy them for work. Another item that I got, and maybe I went a little crazy, but... I have been looking for these ever since I saw them on Instagram, and of course that is the adult coloring books everybody wants. I got Nature to Color, The Joy of Coloring, Exotic Impressions, and this is probably my favorite one, uh, Color Patterns, Places to Color, and Wildlife to Color, Mandalas to Color, and creative awakenings and something that I want to mention about these coloring books that a lot of people may not know if you are like me and you like to color with gel pens as um, instead of crayons or coloring color color pencils excuse me uh, these pages do not bleed I was very surprised as a Dollar Tree coloring book. I did not expect it to hold up better than the more expensive ones, but they really do. Um, if you have ever seen these in your Dollar Tree, hurry up and buy them because they go fast as they don't get a lot of them. I got lucky and was able to find them in mine just on a whim. Everybody knows what these are for. Don't judge me. These are just as accurate as the ones that you buy anywhere else. Um, yeah, it might be might be that time let's just put it that way don't hesitate to buy them they are the same thing in my humble opinion uh, this is a sorry about the camera this is a product that I'm getting ready to show you that I have only recently found in my uh, stores um, I never thought I would find this one because they were always out they had the grapefruit and the brown sugar and vanilla but they never had the coconut shea butter and they have started carrying it so every time I go I tend to buy a bottle to kind of stock up and this is probably the best Dollar Tree um, body wash that I have bought for women. It smells wonderful and I think it's supposed to be like, Lord I can't even remember the name, let's just say it's really good because it is. Another thing I bought, this thing has been in my face now for probably the last couple times I've went and I do record my videos with an iPhone so I went ahead and got me a self portrait button so it would be easier for me to just kind of turn the camera on and off. Um, I wasn't going to get this but what can you say, it says it works with 4S, 5S, 6 and 6 Plus, it has a 48 inch cord so I, it's a dollar, couldn't, couldn't resist so I'll let you know if this works well at a later date. Another thing, sorry about the camera, I have a weird setup as, as of right now. Husband wanted some kitchen bags for his work because he says he's tired of never having any. So I got him these this uh, these 13 gallon ones that smell like Island Breeze and they smell really good. And I got the drawstring ones and I'll probably buy some of these for the house because I like how they smell and they look like they're pretty strong. Um, another thing, I'm going to show you this. I'm currently using the attachment that comes on these that holds uh, the item, but I got a selfie stick. 
it looks like this and it has a bendable neck and it comes with the holder on top but I took it off and it's currently on my camera my phone right now on a tripod and it's really the only reason I bought this I mean it extends pretty good so you could take selfies but I really don't uh, I really just bought this for the attachment um, definitely wor definitely worth it so far as it is holding my phone really really well and it is better made than one that I bought off of eBay for the same purpose the one on off of eBay kept breaking on me uh, so don't hesitate if you're looking for a selfie stick bought some St. Patrick's Day decorations because my husband is Irish and I really like them and I bought this Irish blessing one here's what it says um, the only issue I have with these is where they're cardboard they were a little bit bent where they came out of the boxes but I just said forget it I just get them because you can put books on top of these and that fixes the bend. So I also got this Irish Celtic cross that says Irish Blessings that I thought was really cute. It also has the same bending issue but books will fix the problem. Another boring item but I love the design on this box. I got some more tissues because we go through tissues a lot and I just like that it had the candle holder on it so I went ahead and got that. I have a confession to make. I have an obsession with Dollar Tree face wash. I was trying to not buy more because I have so much as it is. Um, so I went ahead and got this daily renewing skin cleanser by the Dollar Tree. I think this is supposed to be like Olay's version. It says it gently lifts away dull dry skin and I really focus on the gently because my skin has been kind of angry as of late. Uh, so I figured I'd try it and I actually like the scent and I have really started to check the smell of products before I buy them because I'm a little bit picky these days because I don't like buying things that smell bad because I'm very sensitive to smell. Got another one of these screen protectors for my Kindle Fire because these work so well. I got one just to have because sometimes, you know, my Dollar Tree runs out of stuff and they don't get it again. So I picked this up because I'm not paying $17 for one that's actually made for the Kindle where you can just do a little bit of cutting and this one will fit perfectly well. Uh, this comes with a little cloth to clean your screen before you put it on and it has thorough directions on how to apply it and I really like it. So don't hesitate to buy that if you need one. They also carry them for the iPad mini and the iPad Air as far as I know. Had a bit of a sweet tooth. Um, Charleston Chew is one of my favorite candies. So I got the big bar. Couldn't resist. It's a dollar. And so far the Dollar Tree has been the only place I have found the really, really big ones. Uh, another product that has been blowing up on Instagram here lately is the Benzac Solutions set. There's three steps as far as I know. Uh, one's a lotion and one's a spot treatment and this is the skin balancing foam cleanser. I only got this because I was curious because I focused on the calming and soothing oil that's in it uh, since my skin has been angry lately. Um, I looked this up on Amazon and this stuff is $12 a bottle and I don't believe, let me see, it expires in uh, October of this year but I'm pretty certain this will be used up long before then. So if you see this in your stores and you have trouble with acne, I highly suggest that you try it. And cha-cha cakes, I know that your boys have problems with um, acne. I highly suggest that you try this if you see it in your stores. Next item. This item's got a little bit of a story behind it and I feel like I need to tell you what it is. This particular item here had been hanging out in one of the stores that I visit all the time and I figured by the time I went back for it, it would be gone but it was still there. This cup, this one saying, has helped me tremendously in ways that I didn't think that it would. Um, live in the moment. My life has changed dramatically in the last two years as you all well know. This coffee cup has helped me to realize that while my life is different, I shouldn't be living in the past. I shouldn't worry about what I used to be able to do. I should just live for the now and what I can do. So I really want the ones that say nerds rule, but so far I haven't found it. So I thought I would try this one. And this is made by Dollar Tree. So yeah, not really a fan of the green on it, but the, the saying was powerful enough that I really couldn't not buy it. Next thing is a product that I love and I really want to find more of. Yes, it's open because I 
put some in my coffee this morning. And that is sugar in the raw. 25 packets for a dollar. It is turbinado cane sugar. Uh, it is better, in my opinion, than regular sugar. And I really enjoy the taste better than um, artificial sweetener. It is non-GMO verified. And this stuff is expensive in the grocery store. I think a really, really big thing of it is like $6. Um, this particular box, this size, goes for 3 bucks at my local store, so a dollar for 25 packs is a win to me. Another thing that I got was a little bit of a letdown because I just couldn't wait to use it. I had to try it out to tell you about. I've been waiting for this product for probably four or five months. Pretty and Flawed had hauled it on her channel, and I saw it and got really excited, and that is the Pears spearmint and menthol soap i really love anything mint for the bath and i found out that i really didn't like this it burned me rather than cooled me off i don't know if I, my skin was just having a bad day but i'm going to keep it and try it a little ways down the road to see if it is a better experience or if i just got a dud i picked up two because i got so excited over it um so far it's not for me but that's not to say it won't be down the road Try it and let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Did it work for you? Did it not? I'm going to blame this particular um, purchase on Amanda over at Fab TV. I would like to say thank you, girl, for hauling this particular um, toothpaste. I have been using this now for a week and I absolutely love it and I have definitely noticed less sensitivity on my teeth. I have extremely hot and cold sensitive teeth and ever since using this I have noticed a serious decline in that and I have noticed a little bit of whitening on my teeth as well. So it says this is uh, compared to Sensodyne Pronamel and there's no reason to pay five or six dollars for toothpaste when you can pay a dollar for this one by Natural White and it has the exact same ingredients. So this will be something that I haul frequently because it worked really well for me. Um, so if you have hot and cold sensitive teeth and you need something that's a little bit easier on the wallet, I highly suggest that. This next product I'm so on the fence about. I don't know how I feel. I definitely know I'm not going to try the others because I saw what they were. And this is just such a strange texture to me. And that is the goody good stuff candy in the cherry cherries. There's no gelatin, no fat, no gluten, no dairy. All natural colors and flavors. And it's made by... Hang on, I'll find out who makes it. Uh, FTF Sweets in New York. Honestly, this is a very... Because this candy has no gelatin, the way it's made, the candy, candy just kind of melts in your mouth, and it kind of messes with my palate a little bit. I'm not saying you wouldn't like it. It does taste good. It's just such a strange texture for having no gelatin. Where I'm used to, with gummy candies, you have to chew them. You really don't chew this. It just kind of melts in your mouth. And this is what it looks like. I'll open, open it a little bit and show you. Uh, that's what the cherry looks like. And... Like I said, it's just kind of a weird thing for me. I'm sure that it is an okay product for most people. It's just weird on me because of texture problems. Another candy I ha I buy every time I go to the Dollar Tree when I see it, which is beginning becoming more and more rare, is the Creamy Coconut Patties and Key Lime by Anastasia Confections. Uh, they have a regular that's just kind of like an open-faced mound, if you will. Uh, so... I get these every time. Seriously, try them out. They're both delicious. Especially if you have a sugar thing like I do. Alright, I might have went a little bit crazy on this on these, on these, this particular brand of items. I couldn't help it. And I'm probably going to continue to stock up on them until they don't have them anymore. Because they are just so good. And that is the Restores Gummies. I bought two of the vitamin D3, two of the melatonin, and, I, and one of the multivitamin because I hadn't tried it yet. The melatonin has seriously helped me to sleep. Easy to take and it tastes good because I really like strawberry anyway. Um, vitamin D3, it also works. I mean, the thing about gummies for me is it's really easy for me to remember to take these because they taste good. You don't need water. They just, you know, I, I don't know how I feel about the multivitamin yet because I have not taken it. But I will let you know, definitely if you see these restores in your store, don't hesitate to get them. Because, I mean, a dollar is great. And I absolutely am obsessed with these. Um, oh, sorry about the camera, guys. Kind of got it in a weird setup. And I, ha I end up touching it every time I put something to the side. 
Um, next thing, new to my store, new to me, period. I haven't seen this anywhere but the Dollar Tree, and that is the VO5 Dry Scalp Shampoo. I know they have a conditioner, but where my hair is so very short, I don't need conditioner. And I thought, figure, because this had almond oil in it, it would help with the dry scalpness that I suffer from from time to time. The only thing I don't like about this is it has dimethicone in it, which is makes my hair kind of gross at times. But I figure I'll deal with it because a dry scalp with hair that's practically next to your scalp um, will help, you know. Uh, smells really good, and I'll let you know if it's worth it or not. I'm pretty sure it will be because, yeah. I picked these up. I'm not sure if I'm going to use the, give these to my husband for their intended purpose or keep them for myself for cleaning. And that is the microfiber cleaning towels. You get two for a dollar. It says traps and removes dust and dirt. And let me just tell you, as someone who has a lot of dust and dirt in their home, this definitely has helped me to clean my house more effectively. Had a really dirty, um, TV stand that was full of dust and dirt and hair. I used Simple Green and used this to clean it with and it captured everything and there was absolutely no issues and I love the fact that you can wash them. And definitely get yourself some cleaning towels from the Dollar Tree. It will save you money and time. Another thing that I have gotten from the Dollar Tree is I have a bit of an obsession with USB cables as well from the Dollar Tree because I feel like it's just such a great deal. So I got this flat this flat wire cable it has this they both have the same ends and i have used this one once just to test it out uh this helps to charge your smartphone or your tablet um yeah these are really great definitely worth your dollar they last um they don't mess up the way some of the more expensive ones do so don't hesitate definitely worth your dollar at least in my humble opinion Bought my husband a little spray bottle for his RC obsession because the simple green bottle is extremely large. So I got him this little mini spray one to put in his toolbox for his simple green for his tire cleaning solution. It's just so much smaller and so much easier to pack along. Um, next thing, as I told you, the coloring books, I really enjoy using gel pens. And the first gel pens that I got to check and see if gel penning would be for me were these ones from the Dollar Tree by Cello Top Gel. Uh, blue, purple, pink, and orange. These are very vibrant colors. They work well. Um, definitely worth your dollar. The purple one tends to pull a lot more, but I don't mind that. These are made by the Dollar Tree, so if you see these, don't hesitate. Um, I picked up a set from the from Walmart that was twelve dollars. It came with metallic glitter and neon, but I will still use those just because they are really good. Another thing that has been blowing up Instagram and the local groups as of lately on Facebook is this right here. Everyone says this is amazing. I have seen people use this not just for laundry but for air freshener sachets in their cars, in laundry rooms. Um, I feel like maybe you could use these in a wax melter if you were brave enough. Um, I use this to make my own um, laundry detergent. Uh, this is just the scent booster that I put in it. This is really worth your dollar. I think they make a blue and a a blue and a yellow, but the only one I my stores have had is the pink one. Um, if I could buy this in a case, I would just because of the price savings on it. Uh, most fabric beads are around six dollars a thing and this is a dollar and you get a nice scoop and that's what they look like they're made just like the downy ones um so if you find these in your store give them a shot i mean it's only a dollar if you hate it what do you got to lose um it smells fantastic and you can put it directly into your washer next item you've seen this a thousand times on my channel Hyperclean shower gel for men. Buy this all the time. Love the spiciness of it. Not going to spend too much time on it because you see it so often. This was a hilarious mess up on my part. Uh, Vitamilt, vitamin C by Nature Made. Six dollars a bottle at your local Walmart. What I thought I was grabbing was the vitamin, the multivitamin one. Uh, I think 200 tablets for a dollar is a great deal. And I need vitamin C on a daily basis. Um, kind of a happy accident. It's an easier way to take vitamin C rather than giant horse pills. You can take up to eight a day, but it'll probably just be two for me. A 60 milligrams is supposed to be your 100% daily need. 
So if you see these, grab them because I don't imagine they're going to last real, real long in our stores. Here's a bit of a mini review of this next item. I have officially went through my first bottle of this. And that is the uh, Assure Dental Rinse Anti-Plaque. It's basically plaques. Dollar Tree's version of plaques. I've been having trouble with plaque here lately. And I bought this. And I tried it because it's a pre-rinse. It's what you, you rinse your mouth with it for 30 seconds before you... Um, brush your teeth, you spit it out, and then it helps to loosen plaque that you already have going on. This stuff's amazing. It's just like plaques. I'm not paying five dollars for something I can pay a dollar for. Um, it's helped my gum health and helps your teeth to feel cleaner and healthier. Definitely worth it. So if you have plaque issues and you need plaques, don't go and buy plaques. Buy this because it's the same thing. Definitely worth your dollar. I'm just going to kind of speed by this one because you see it so much. Everybody knows how much I love pears, so I got a regular bar just in case. Next item, I've been, I have walked past this item a thousand times in my Dollar Tree since I have seen it because I recently got a coffee press. Um, I haven't really thought about it too much, but then I thought the, the mug cover would be nice, and that's the tea infuser set for loose leaf tea. I thought this was just so adorable, and I just wanted it mainly for the mug cover. So yeah, I think this would make great Christmas gifts for people, so stock up if you see them and they like tea. Definitely worth it, I believe. Everybody needs batteries. Had to get some AAAs, and so I did. Another item that I picked up, and forgive the uh, Kool-Aid in the bottom, but I've been using it, is the 30 fluid ounce uh, bottles, water bottles they have here lately at the Dollar Tree, and I thought the uh, design was cute, just don't like how big the hole is on the end, but what are you going to do for a dollar? They came in orange, pink, green, and blue. Really love this. This is equivalent to uh, three cups. So it definitely helps my water intake during the day. Another FYI, I did not buy this at the Dollar Tree, but I know that they have been selling it there lately. I got this at Big Lots, this Reach Anti-Plaque. Um, I just want to tell you, based on finding this there, they sell a lot of the same uh, products that the Dollar Tree does in the essentials area for health, like shampoo, toothpaste, face wash. And I found this, so I got it just kind of as a backup to my plaques when I am out. Next item, and last but certainly, actually no, I got a few more. Uh, everybody's been talking about the Pink Toe Salon Selectives, condi the conditioner treatment. And I saw this one and I thought it was a little different. It's a damage repair, corrective hair treatment, sulfate free. So I thought I would try this as I'm getting ready to dye my hair purple. I thought this would help repair some things. It smells really good. Uh, so yeah, if you see this, give it a shot. It might be as good as the ones that everybody has been blowing up Instagram about. I have a lot of scarring on my arms and, of course, my surgery scar from cancer. And I saw this product and I thought that this would be something good to try. Uh, this is supposed to be compared to Mederma, which I've heard is really expensive, but it works. Especially formulated for scars caused by injury, surgery, stretch marks, acne, and burns. Um... I thought this would be good to try. I'll show you the scar that I'll be working on is that one. That's pr These are pretty hardcore. These are from cats. And I've always scarred really bad as in the last couple of years. Those were not, those were very superficial scratches. So I thought maybe this would help since they're, they're not particularly deep. I have more hope for those than the one on my neck. So we'll see if this is any, this is any good. And this is new to my Dollar Tree. Um had a project planned for my clothing. I've been having issues with too many clothing. Too much clothing, sorry. Um, I have been using these store heavy duty storage bags for a long time and this is just the uh, XL. You get two for a dollar and uh, here's the diagram of the really, you know, little, big and really big. I've used the really big ones for yarn before and they're really good. Um, I'm going to be putting away shirts that we haven't worn for a long time, and if they stay in the bag for a year, I'm going to send them to consignment or donate them to Goodwill. So, yeah. Well, that's everything I picked up at the Dollar Tree this week. I just want to thank you all for hanging with me this long, um, visiting my channel. You know, let me know down in the comment section below what you think about... Um, the format. Do you want this format to be kept or do you want to see more of my face? Just let me know in the comment section below. I hope you all 
Have a great week. You be blessed and good luck on finding some of these items at your Dollar Tree. See you later. Mm -hmm.